Alright gamers, welcome back. We're playing Atlas, and thank you so much for joining me. Hope you guys are having a great morning. We're back here in Atlas, just trying to tame stuff, boy, and it's, uh, it's not that easy. I have the taming up. Oh, there he is. There he is. Oh, ostrich. Um, boy, what are we gonna call this thing? <laughs> there we go. I've been trying to tame things here in this desert biome, and it is, uh, is not great. It's super hard. It's super hot all the time. I'm constantly dying. It's nuts. Uh, so we're gonna be leaving. I just wanted to see if I could tame an ostrich, and bam, there you go. Two of them in my pen, in my pen here. Uh, one of them I had to take out. Uh, kind of tricky, actually. So let's call this one here, um, this one, this is gonna be Ostrich Rob here. What is that up there? Okay. Very good. What do we look like here, Rob? Oh, very, very nice. Actually, not too shabby. A little brown, a little purple there. Can we equip a saddle to ride? Okay, this one we had to kill because I, it's really hard to get their health low, actually. And I didn't see two. I only saw one. I, I shot him from a distance. He came running. I, I went like this, you know, up here. The same trap that everybody in the world builds. It's fantastic. So the nice thing about this is that you open up these doors, and normally speaking, he can walk right through like that. And uh, there you go. We got ourselves an ostrich. There are tons of rhinoceros as well. Oh, that's only level 5. That's brutal, man. You're not a very high level, and you look like a rooster. What, what is that? That's probably what we should have called this thing. You know? That's what we should have called this thing. Well, okay, we'll just leave it be. You follow me. Um, so we were able to actually get a uh, rhinoceros as well. Uh, he's hanging out back at, uh, at the ship. And I said, you know what, just before we leave, I've been collecting salt like crazy. This island is not great. There's no water, and it's hot all the time, so I'm constantly thirsty. And um, I'm not going to be able to stay. I'm not going to be able to stay and explore the whole thing. See, here's more rhinoceros. There's rhinoceros everywhere. There's also giraffe. But we might have to come back for a giraffe an another time. So there you go. We are back here in Atlas. And it is late in the day, actually, here in Atlas. We are, have the sun going down. Thankfully, uh, this time of the day, it seems like it's not as um, not as hot. Could it be? But every once in a while, there's like this heat wave that just smacks us, and it, and we don't... What is that thing on the ground? Oh, that's it. Okay, we got this. Let's just make sure we're fully loaded, though. We did take out our ostrich. So you gotta get their health really low, and then bowl of them, and then try to feed them. And I found out that actually using the shield that I have, it protects me from him smacking me around. Because when he's in a pen, they're none too happy. And, uh, come here, you stinking cobra. Come on. Oh, that was a terrible shot. Feel the wrath. There. <laughs> he takes a bite out of him. He's stinking. We can't ride that without a saddle, right? No. Okay, no problem. What has he got in? He's only 122 health. These things aren't super strong. I hope I have room on my on my ship for him and the rhino. The rhino is humongous. <laughs> but I couldn't pass it up. When I saw them on the on the beach there, I said, well, let me see what I can do. I actually went for the giraffe. The giraffe got taken out by a, a cobra before I could get there. Not a cobra. A, um, a crocodile. Which was almost dead, so I took a pot shot at it, and, uh... You see, look at this weather, though, man. Anyway, so I'm gonna see if I can get this ostrich here up on the boat with my rhino, and, uh, yeah, so that's basically how I've been doing the taming. Uh, I wasn't really planning on doing too much taming when I got here, but, uh, you know what, when I saw the rhino, I was kind of like, okay, how do I do it? How do I do it? <laughs> so I took care of that business. Uh, also... Oh, there you are, there you are, okay. Stay right there, buddy. Now, you, I need you on passive so you don't get any ideas about whatever that bird is doing here. Um, attack your target. No, where is it? Ah, disable. Oh, I must be here. Uh, neutral. Yeah, this is it. Passive. Okay, everybody's on passive. There you go. In fact, let's give this guy a little bit of food. A little bit. I think, uh, this guy's got... See, Jerry here is level 27. That's fantastic. Okay. And apparently you can only tame them with vegetables that you grow from your garden, so thank goodness I brought myself some wheat. <laughs> my wheat is the only thing I can feed these things. The thing, the, everything raw that I'm picking up off the ground, uh, not working. So, yeah. I might, should I do another one? What's the weight now on our ship? It doesn't seem to change the weight. I could be wrong. I don't know. But we've got like a, literally a boatload of salt in here. Uh, like, look at all salt. I even started converting it into uh, preserving salts because this is only seven. Right? So it would take 500 of these and converts it to preserving salts, but I do want some raw salt as well. So there's that and there's all of this. It doesn't even look like that much, but it should last in about an eternity. So that's good. Uh, and if worse comes to worse, we'll come back and get more, but I'm just sick of dying. <laughs> I'm sick of dying. So let me just have a look here. I think this whole biome, that's not the map I want to see. I want to see this big one here. And this, this looks like this whole area, this has changed. Because the research I did on this area was not this. Um... Although it did say there was salt over here, and sure enough, we found salt. So I think, let me see. Can we see which way the wind is blowing? 
Hey, everybody. <laughs> this is pretty cool. I, I wouldn't mind just getting my teams back home, to be honest, but what do we got here? See, the wind is still blowing this way. Kind of, let's see, kind of... Oh, interesting. It's kind of blowing northwest? Hmm, so we might be able to turn right around, actually. We might be able to turn right around. So that little hut right there is basically... And I put a bed in there because I was just... I mean, literally getting slaughtered out here. <laughs> See, it was nuts. It's nuts. I, I don't understand what to do with that. I, I tried clothes, no clothes. I, I tried uh, going in the water. That that helped a little bit, and then the heat wave ended anyways. So I'm not sure. Um, all right, so it doesn't seem like there's too many heat waves at night, though. Which is nice. I might just use an evening time here to travel. So I wouldn't mind going back to K5. Head head back east if I can. And, well, not like that, buddy. And let's see if we can get that done. Um, can we turn around? No, I gotta go like this. I don't know that I can turn here. Alright. Well, I'll get us out to sea here. Because it does take a second here to turn stuff around. And uh, we might have to zigzag home. I'm not entirely sure. But we'll see. Oh, uh, there's a cobra. Yeah, non-stop harassment on this place, man. Just the weather alone. So I gotta stay somewhere where the weather's better, but... Alright, let's get out of here. And we're back. And we've made ourselves uh, a little spot here for our rhinoceros. And um, it is not super safe on the beach here, but it's not bad. And I think if I just leave him... Oh, okay. Uh, if I just leave this guy in neutral, he should be able to take care of himself. I stuck, um, I stuck the bird up there. They're not really able to defend themselves too much. And I actually made, like, a huge mistake. Um... It turns out that riding those birds actually ha protects you from hyperthermia. So it would have protected us from the heat. I was dying like crazy on that uh, desert island. And I think I would have been better off if I just jumped on my bird. Um, but I didn't know about that. That being said, of course, I didn't have a saddle. So I kind of had to get out of there anyways. And so we're back home. But my rhinoceros should be able to collect me a ton of rocks. I've been trying to unload my ship, basically. I, I docked it over there. I, I almost made a huge mistake with that, too. I put the Olivia... I almost put the Olivia right inside of there. <laughs> Don't do that, because you can't back up. So I kind of came in on, an, on a bit of an angle, and I was like... Anyway, that being said, we are not going to stay here much longer. I just kind of was unloading stuff and getting ready. I also decided... Can I, can I still get up here? I also decided I'm going to get rid of uh, my... Ooh, okay. I, I'm going to get rid of my... This guy can't... Well, see, where my, see, there's a cobra over there. Sometimes those cobras make their way over here, but... Um, anyway, that being said, I got rid of... I can't get up here, right. I was working on this, and I probably should continue. Put a ramp to the roof, just to get my animals up higher, uh, off the ground kind of thing. But I took... I got rid of all the water that I had here. It wasn't working anyway. I came back in, and it's all, like, not irrigated once again. <laughs> so, I don't know what's going on with that thing. I think you gotta put them up, maybe on the roof or something, because it wasn't collecting rain, it wasn't collecting water from the ground, it wasn't doing anything. So I got rid of all the pipes, got rid of everything. Don't need it anyway. It's kind of like raining here all the time. Anyway, so but it, you don't really need an irrigation system per se, unless it's for maybe cooking. Uh, so I might get into that when we get back. But for the time being, I, I gotta find some gem, and I figured today might be another good day to go out and you know really explore another island. So I kind of was looking at the map. No, not this map, buddy. Not no 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 not that map, buddy. I was kind of looking at this map here. Now we we kind of swung by this one on the way home, and I think what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go straight south. Uh, I believe. I'm gonna go go to this island here, see what we can find. This one here's got two camps. I think I think this one's a fairly big island. This is another small one, which, you know, and I think this one down here is actually gonna be a small one as well. So it's just if there's a pirate ship, it makes it a bit of a problem. But anyway, we'll take the Olivia out. We'll try to get her there again. Um so are you on are you on let's see here, buddy? What are you on? Behavior. Oh, you're on neutral. Oh, he's on neutral. Okay, very good. Yeah, so if anything comes around, he'll just smack the daylights out of it. Uh, I wouldn't mind taking him with me, but I think what we're going to do is... What do I have on me here? I took some treasure maps as well. You never you never really know. I'm taking... Definitely have my grappling hook. See, here's this too. This is the only... What is this called? Common cloth. So the cloth armor also protects you from hyperthermia, and I didn't know that. Hyperthermic insulation 15, it says, just from the basics. So, that's pretty good. Uh, I'm taking some bolas. In fact, let's also take... This guy's my basically my elevator right now. Look at this. That's right. <laughs> there you go. So I think I'm also going to take with me. Let me see here. What do I have on me? I think I have some foundations. Because we're going to need... Why am I carrying salts? I don't know. we got to make sure we don't take nonsense. Okay, buddy, how about that? Let's leave the salt and the fertilizer behind. I don't know. I must have been still transporting some stuff. Also seeds. Okay. See, we don't have a lot. Is this onion? Yeah, I planted a few more onions. Um, let's see here. We're going to take some meat. No, that's fine. This is actually excess meat. I don't really... I don't know. Also, I wouldn't mind bringing, like, a bow and arrow. When it comes time to taming, man, I was trying to tame these birds, and I was, like, killing them with my stinking crossbow. So, I, I, you need something a little weaker, and I think maybe a crossbow would be the trick there. 
Um, do I have? I thought I was gonna bring some foundations. I have some stone ones there. I got a bunch of metal in there. This, where are this? Is thatch foundations? Which, where did I put those things? Maybe they're already on the ship. I don't know. All right. Um, we got fire going here. This thing here. Look at that. I put my I put my salt in there. I'm at 4.99. This is gonna last forever now. <laughs> this is fantastic. It's absolutely fantastic. I need more of those. To be honest. I need more of those bags. We've got to like, create like a whole fridge area. That'd be great. But we're not going to work on the base today. We're going to go see if we can't find some gems on the southern island. We'll go explore it. I think it's small enough, and I believe there are gems there. So we should be able to get through the whole thing. Um, all right, well, let me get down there. Let me get rolling, and we'll get ourselves out to sea. And then, of course, we'll we'll sail for a little bit. It's going to be tough. I think the wind is against us. I also have a fire going over here, which is all pretty awesome at nighttime. Just throw a ton of wood in there. See, there's all a bunch of resources off the ship as well. Oh, my life. Uh, for building ships and things like that, but I'm holding on to it for now because it's going to be for my what do you call it? Brigantine. Let's just see what we got here. So there's our leather. So let's also put these in there. Our cloth will go in there. Transport that with us. There's a bunch of extra stuff here I probably shouldn't be bringing with me. Let's actually throw these little maps in there as well. Alright, we should be okay. We should be okay. I don't seem to have a foundation though. I want to. Well, I can always build it when I get there, I guess. Oh my gosh! Look at all the food we have in there. Yeah, we're doing just fine here. Is this cooked? No, it's not. Prime fish meat. If we come across any cats or something like that, all kinds of food in there. That's nuts. All right, so I think we should be good to go this year. Also, we got to get crew for real. We do have to get crew. Oh, how much money is in there? Forty? Well, oh, fifty-four. Okay, we're not doing too bad. We have to go do some of that too. Um, we'll go get ourselves some. All right, let's see if we can actually get out of here. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Did you see that? Nice. Can we just turn this a little bit? A little smack in the side here. Let's put this down. And once we're moving, jump back on here. And turn, buddy, turn. Okay. Yeah, the wind's going to be against us, so it's going to be a bit of a slow trip. I'm going to have to get myself going exactly south, which I believe is just to our right here. So it's going to be kind of awkward, but I'll get us there. I'll bring you back when we're a little closer to the island here because this is gonna be this is gonna be a while. And we're coming in here. We are coming in. This is pretty sweet. I just kinda did a little zigzag really. Like a minor one. Like look at the wind we've got in our sails up there on the top right. Not much, right? And we're kinda going kinda slow. It looks like the left hand side here, or the eastern side of this island I should say, is um kinda rocky or whatever, but it looks like there's a, might be a decent landing spot right there if we don't have any problems i'll just veer it off to the starboard side and we will uh, we'll get off on the port side we'll just jump off right there but we'll just kind of come in on an angle but this is a decent yeah this is decent there's nobody out here which is nice unless like a pirate ship pops into view here but um because there, there will be what was it one or two there's two right two pirate camps on this little island so that's a bit of an issue but i believe this this we should be able to find some ruby here some some red stones that are like up on I don't know on the side of these mountains maybe or something I have no idea I've never found them I haven't found them yet but we need them we need them actually because we have silver everywhere and silver needs to be mixed with gem in order to get like alloys and I can't I can't make any rifles or, or cannons or anything and hey, what's this over here should we be coming along that side you know what I think we're gonna go over there yeah that looks a little too rocky it might be difficult to get off on that side so let's just turn it around like this Let's turn it right around like this. Alright, we might be oversteering it here. We might be. Well, we are oversteering it. Okay. Oh, buddy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's way oversteering, man. What are you doing? We kind of want to still go this way, buddy. We've got the wind right at our backs. Okay, that should be plenty. Let's, let's get like this. Right in our face, I mean, not our backs. I wish. Okay, let's go like this. That'll catch us a little bit of wind, right? And then... Hopefully we don't have any pirates here. And I have to, like... I'm, I'm looking on the horizon there, but I don't see any... Well, I see something. What is that? What is that? Let's go see. What is that? Uh, is it just... I don't know what that is. Oh, it is a pirate ship. Oh, fantastic. Isn't it? Okay. Oh, okay. All right. All right, buddy. Let's just turn that one off. Well, let's just turn ourselves right around here if we can. Can we 
do this? Can we do this? We should... The wind will die out. Okay, so we don't want to go that way. We do want to basically either get off right here. Although this looks like the pirate, the pirate camp is right there. Okay. All right, all right. We're good. We're good. A little bit of excitement right at the end here. Hold on. <laughs> we'll just do a one sail trip here. I, the, how this thing oversteers is crazy. All right, so we'll see if we can't sneak along the side here. Okay, buddy. Oh, here we go. Let's see if we can do some fancy maneuvering here right at the last second. I do have my grapple hook if I have to climb up there. So, oh, look, there's maple tree right at the top of that hill. Ooh. We'll get some syrup here as well. Oh, there's more right there. Oh, yeah. So that's pretty good. Okay, so here's hoping there isn't anything too exciting on this other side. Maybe, usually it's just one side, right? I don't know. We'll see. We got some bottles here. Schooner's leveling up like a champ. So this is going to be hard to sneak around this end. We're not going to have very much wind here. Okay, let's see what we got. Stink. That would have been a nice place to land, but I don't feel like abandoning my ship there. So we can actually anchor right here. Hmm. Oh, actually, okay, it might not be too bad to do that. Can we just come in nice and easy right here? Look at this. Beautiful. Maybe we can get off right here, and it might not be too bad. So I can anchor here. This is really good. What is that over there? A horse? So I'm not too sure about what's hazardous on this island or what, but it would be nice if I could just come alongside this more shallower area here. Oh, this is nice. Ooh, okay. It's nice, but I don't know. We're looking for red, red stone or something like that. I'm not sure exactly what it looks like, but we're going to go see. Um, okay, we're coming in hot here. This is nice. Although it's forested, I don't know what we're going to meet here, but I've got, I've got all my gear with me. Don't you worry. We're all set here. So we have a... Come on, turn, buddy. We have a ladder here. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I'm pressing C. Wrong button. There we go. Okay, we're all set here. Nice. And it looks like we're pretty safe. We've got our ladders down. We do. Uh, what are we going to... Oh, I have a shovel, of course, which is good, but that's not what I want. Oh, my goodness. My, this thing is almost done. I didn't realize the durability on my... Mm, stink. Wait a second. I think we can fix it down here. Can we not? Do I not have what it takes here? Let's see. Carotenoid. Since when do I need that? <laughs> I got tons of that stuff. Um, hmm. Okay. We'll have to make that a priority and get some. Okay. Maybe a snake or something? Let's go see. Come on, buddy. Jump off. How deep is it here? It's very deep. Okay. If we ever have, like, um, a shark or something, we're going to be in trouble. Those sharks are huge, by the way. Oh. Follier's, Follier's Island. Oh, very, very good. How are we loaded up here? Let's make sure we're ready for action. <clears throat> well, I have a sword as well. I guess if I can take out the smaller stuff with the sword, that's fine. It's just the, like, you know, if you get like a cobra or something, you don't really want to be up in it, up in its face. Okay, so let's see what we can find here. Keep our eyes peeled. I wouldn't mind heading towards that maple syrup that we saw earlier. Boy, this is rocky, isn't it? This is going to be rocky. All right, can we, can we, hmm. We get up here by foot, or do we have to, like, grapple it? I don't really want to waste my grapple, but I guess I will if I have to. Okay, buddy. We might just have to go around. We run into a, a tiger or something, we're going to be in trouble. Can you not get up here, buddy? That would have been nice if you could have just jumped up there. That would have been sweet. All right, here we go. Okay, here we go. Oh, man, is it ever forced? If something pops out of here, we're going to be, like, spooked. Um... Wow, okay. <laughs> I don't know how we're going to find anything in this brush. There must be a cleared area somewhere, but it's probably over where the pirates are, right? So let's just have a look-see, actually. Oh, it doesn't show it here. Hold on. It'll show us how many... Was it two or one? It's just two pirate camps on this little island of nothing. So we're here. So we're near the stone. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's what we want. I believe that's where we're going to find the ruby, I, I, I think. We'll see. Let's keep our eyes open. Let's keep our wits about us. I don't feel like dying on this place. Hey, buddy. Wild female cow. No doubt. All right, what do we got? Oh, here's a maple tree right here. Sweet. Let's take this out while we're here, shall we? So we get quite a bit, actually. What do I have? The, I'm at a three, I think. Yeah, it's three or... F no, taming's at four. So I have the collection at three, which is fine. It's a lot, but it's... Oh, here's another one. Isn't it on? No, it doesn't look like it. Oh, it's weird. It looks like the same bark. 
All right, let's keep our eyes peeled here. If we got to go up somewhere. We'll use our grapple, no problem. I'm not afraid to use it. All right, let's see. Anything here? I don't see any red blobs on the side of these mountains. That's supposed to be where they are, but we'll see. We'll see. Oh, this is crazy. This is a real thick brush. We're probably going to be getting cannons shot at us while we're trying to get our ruby. A like hundred bucks says, you know. I bet you anything. Okay, what is this thing? Giant tree. Nice. Okay, so what do we have here? This is really crazy land here. What, what is this mess, man? All right, so I think... Was it not up here? We saw more maple trees. I'm going to grab some of that, although... Oh, no, no, no. Not the map, buddy. Although, where's our weight here? Our weight's already, like, at max. So, because I'm carrying around walls... Right. Let's just toss that for a second. We're going to find gem and not be able to carry it home. Grab a little water. And actually, we're really hungry, too, aren't we? What do we need? Not much. We need fruits. Some solid meat. We need some vegetables. Oh, we have vegetables in our zero. Right there. Perfect. <clears throat> okay, that, that'll get us going here. Come on, get up here, buddy. This, this is um, this is some crazy landscape on this island, for real. Oh, where do I go? Oh, come on, buddy. I don't want to be grappling up every little step of the way. This guy doesn't want to get up here. He doesn't like this landscape, not even a little bit. With this wild female rabbit, we're all set. Okay. Look at this. <clears throat> Excuse me. It looks like we're doing okay with that. I'm not going to be able to carry all of this. Because, oh, I have foundations. Oh, that's right. I have this stuff down here. Stink. I was supposed to leave that on the boat. Uh, you know what? All we've done so far is found maple syrup anyways, which we have, we have quite a bit of. But let's just see if we can't eyeball it from here. So that way we know where to come. Once our pockets are empty. Actually, you're supposed to empty your pockets. But, oh, right there. That's it right there. Okay, so let me see something here. My map. Oh, you know what? Th this map is, is okay. But this, this big map is just too good. Because you, you can put markers and everything. So, and you do markers just by dragging these yellow things over here. And it goes right where your mouse is. So, it's we're kind of looking at it across the way. So, it should be right here. We're going to do gems right there. And it's going to be... What color can we make this that's going to really pop out? Um, like a blue, maybe? I don't know. Dark blue? What else, or what else we got? Black doesn't really... Uh, let's pick something nice. Well, I thought it'd be like a bright yellow or something, but that doesn't look like, too, like it's too bright to me. All right, let's go like this, this blue. I don't know if we can change it later. Yeah, right there. Perfect. Gems. Okay. Let's get out of here. How are we going to get up there? Okay, rabbit. All right, so let's go empty out our stuff. Let's see if we can make it back here in one piece without falling down to our doom here. I don't know what kind of wild animals are here. I, don't, I, would, have, I would have imagined we could get some cobras, maybe some some lions or whatever. But this is quite a landscape for that. Uh, let's see. Where are we? Where's our ship? Hello, ship? Isn't it over here somewhere? Oh, my life. Why does it not show me? <laughs> where, where are you, man? Where am I? That's the real question. I thought most of these islands were flat, but it turns out, like, uh, no. No, no. There's there's rocky weirdness all, all over the place. Okay. What's that up there? Is that coal? Or is that just rocks? Looks like we found gems, though. Looks like there's tons of them. Oh, there you are. There you are. Oh, we, we, we went a distance, actually. Look at this landscape. Oh, mackerel. Okay, let me go, let me go unload my stuff, and I will be right back. And we're back. And there was some, uh, some metals back there, and there is the rubies, it would appear, right here. And qu quite a bit, to be honest, quite a bit. Let's see if we gotta, like, I don't know. Can we stand up there? It looks pretty, hmm. Ah, oh, we should be able to stand up here. It just looks really steep. Oh, we're good, we're good. Okay, we're good. We found a bunch of rubies here. Fantastic, so actually with our gather rate, this might actually get heavy fast. Yeah, it's getting heavy fast. Oh, it is getting... <laughs> it's getting heavy fast. So three times gather rate, and we just went crazy. Um, oh, stink. All right, so there, there you go. So maybe what I'm going to do... This is going to take some doing, to be honest, if I'm going to get most of these rubies. I'm thinking maybe what we should have done, because there's metal just over here. Maybe we should build, like, a little smelting area. Oh, man, I can barely move. Um, there's a little smelting area by the beach or something. Or maybe we can build it right here. I'm not sure. Because that way, maybe what we can do is just make alloys right here. And then bring alloys back instead of transporting all these rubies. You know what I'm saying? That might be an interesting idea. But we're kind of... 
Is this it? No. I don't even know where it is. It was right here. It was... Oh, there it is right there. Okay, what was it? Oh, I need even too heavy to jump right here. So this should be like silver. And if I just follow this path... Is this more silver? No, that's just rock. If I follow this path, I hit the boat. So, okay. I'm going to do a little collecting of rubies, I guess. That's what we're going <laughs> to... That's what we're here for. So I'm going to do that. See, here's more, more silver right here. So if I build like a little hut right here... And put a smelter in it and just use it as a smelting location. That, that might be good to get the silver in there. Well, not too close to the silver node. We don't want to lose it. But, I don't know, over here maybe? It would only take maybe four foundations, right? And then we can throw down the um, the smelter. I'd have to make one or bring one back. That might be a future project right there. That might be that might be all right. That we can just like, you know, we can throw a bunch of wood in there. And just have like the thing burning away, making us alloys like crazy. Uh, either that or I have to go to an island where I can get some cheaper stuff. I mean, like, if you do it with copper or with uh, metals or something like that, uh, it's it's apparently a little bit easier. But, like, with silver, I need gems, which is crazy, man. I, I, you need gems for just about... Oh, yeah, I can't go that way. You need gems for just about um, all the good stuff, like levers and lighthouses and all kinds of stuff. So, ooh, okay. <laughs> all right, so I'll do some transporting here because this looks like it's going to take a while. And then uh, we'll have to move on. Uh, but there you go. I found some gems. Or I should say, those are ru they're gems, but the the ruby version of the gems. So there we go. We found them right on that island there, and it is with my current gather rates, it's like insane. So all right, I'll fill up as many as I can here, and we'll be back. And we got what we came for, and we are doing a 180. <laughs> we are heading back. And the nice part about going back home here is we got the wind in our sails, man. We are rolling now. So there you go. I actually that was a pretty good little stop. I just go right through those trees. And we got ourselves a bunch of... Yeah, we're going to have to just pay attention, though, to what's going on out at sea, though. Uh, we got, like, a bunch of gems. So I think I should have more than enough to do what I want to do. Um, and then some, I think... Well, I'll make some alloy. I, I don't know how much alloy it takes, but, of course, we're going to need alloy just for, like, repairs and things like that. So maybe one day I'll come back and make, like, a little forge or whatever. I might just make everything back home and then bring it here kind of thing, you know? Like, I, I didn't want to put down my, my stone foundations. I want to kind of keep my stone foundations for my my home base here on the shark home or whatever the heck this place is called that we're living at but uh, yeah this is nice when you have the wind in your sails boy you're moving it's sweet look at that crate this thing here full oh no not like that buddy there we go that thing there full of gems and uh i don't know, some maple syrup too some little syrup while we were there a little oh you see should we try to get this thing here uh, can we can we can we close that down come on buddy let's go where is it Did we go flying by it uh, let's see if we can get this thing. Oh, we missed it. Okay, we might still be able to get it. Let's go. Uh, like a crate would be nice. Oh, there we go. There it comes. There we go. It's a purple one, too. That's pretty good. There it is. 12 coins. Oh, nice. Okay, so let's get rolling here. I don't know if there's anybody out here. Let's just hold on to our hook. I mean, we'll grab a few things on the way back if we can. I just don't like stopping when the pirates show up or whatever but let's go yeah if we can grab another one or two of those that's pretty good how, how much did we get there ah 12 coins that's pretty good so we, i think we need five coins to buy a crew member which means we got to go back to a free port but a free port is just east of us um what is it like l5 or something like that so we should be okay we should be able to get back to there and in fact there was um crystal at that free port that we were at last time i believe i believe also i have a treasure map for that island over there to our west but i don't know i'm still kind of i might i might try to go back to where we were originally and just try to take those guys on but i would have loved to have taken my rhinoceros but transporting a rhino on these little um schooners is 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 a bit of a challenge when you got to change the you know you got to change the sails and this and that and um yeah, he's big. He's in the way. And I literally had to, like, jump on top of him and then jump off of him. And, and just to get from one sail to the next, it was bonkers to get back home. So, I don't... Not really gonna... Not really in the mood for that. <laughs> in the mood for that. But, uh... Alright, so we're gonna... I think we're gonna have pretty smooth sailings here. There are... There are, um... Ships of the Dam just off our... Our port side... Our, our starboard side here. Um... But much closer to home. So if I just hug along the side of this island here, which is our home, we should be... Oh, here's another one. Here's another one. Here's another one. Turn this one off, buddy. Come on, stop, stop. Why does it do that to me? I got this little freezing action here. Okay. Where is it? Must be anchored. Yeah, yeah. Where is it? Where is it? Did we pass it? We might have passed it. Ooh. Okay. There it is. There it is. Okay, we can... We can, buddy? 
Oh man, it's top two. Oh, don't go off the side, buddy. Okay. Can we can we do this? Oh. There it is. That's a long throw, but we got it. Anybody out here? Just dolphins? Nobody else? Good, good. I think there's another purple one. Sweet. Yeah, we can collect a little bit of gold like this. This is pretty handy, to say the least. There it is. Four gold coins. What do we get? Blueprint journeyman something. All right. It's not as good as like a big treasure, obviously, but what are you going to do? We'll get a big treasure when we're okay, fully open. I don't know. The dolphins are losing their minds out here. Um, yeah, we got like a big treasure when we actually take on like massive amounts of guys. Oh, that's pretty good. I got a couple of, and there's a wreckage right there. We ever get the bigger ship? Well, we could put a diving thing on here, but I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> I don't know. All right, let's head this way. Keep our eyes peeled for any more. If we were just sailing nice and calmly, if I didn't have like a boatload of, literally a boatload of gems, I'd just kind of be exploring a little bit. But we should probably do a little exploring with the, um, with the sloop. It's not super fast, but but we could probably just come out to sea and get a little bit of, uh, you know, get a little bit of boxes here. Pick up a little treasure here and there. And if we lose the ship, well, it's no big deal, right? The schooner is the one that we bought. The Erica is the one that we bought. We will rebuild her if we have to. We'll do it. I have the parts, in fact. I have the parts for a brigantine as well. So we should probably be putting that together fairly soon. But I wouldn't mind getting a little crew... I don't know if you can give the crew like swords and things like that and then they help fight alongside you if you when you go up against them um, I don't know when you go looking for a real treasure <laughs> oh man and then there's something like a two gold coins in every five hours or something like that which is really not that expensive I mean but still you when you have them you, you would want like a few thousand gold I would think but some of these treasure boxes like treasure maps or whatever that they give you and there's only about 150 gold coins and some of the little common ones and then the then you know the, the obviously the harder ones get more more serious. Okay, let's keep our eyes open here on the on the uh, starboard side because uh, that's where the ship of the damned are, are hiding out. And I think, well, actually, I think that's our home not too far here. Let's just get a little closer to the island without beaching ourselves here. As we get closer, we'll just go down to one sail and we should be okay. Oh, they're not here. They are there, but the draw distance is pants. I don't know why that is, too. We, we, we should be able to see the ships of the dam from, like, really far away so we can go around them. I don't like them popping in like that. I don't like that at all. Okay, we should just be around the bend here. They pop in. I mean, they haven't really, you know, chased me down or anything, but... This is a shark tooth home, I think is what it's called. Pretty nice island. I like this. The only thing it's missing is the gems and the crystals, of course, but... It's okay. We make little trips back to Freeport. We'll get our crystals there. And then, of course, we've got the gems just down south. Although, we just picked up, like, a boatload of them. Like, literally. <laughs> it's, it's, I must have, like, 2,000? Something like that? Maybe more? It's going to take me an eternity just to... All right. So, I think what we're going to have to do here is just, just close this one down. We're coming in a little too hot for my tastes. There we go. Yeah. So, what we're going to do is just go to the left of our rocks here. Well, not to the left of our rocks, to the right of the rocks. But the rocks on our left, that's what I'm saying. Okay, and then we can just come like this. I'm glad we picked up a little, get a little more wind on our sails. And then once we're docking distance, hopefully we can come in the same way we have previously. Let's go down 50%. Slow her down a little bit. Oh, we're gonna be it's gonna be tight. It's gonna be tight. See, I need a proper dock for real. Like this is a this is a shipyard. It's not really a dock, right? But we come in like this. Come on, buddy. There it is. There it is. <laughs> you gotta watch the little icon on the right hand side there, man. As soon as you can dock, bam. Alright, fully close that sail up. We are good to go. So we should be putting our gold, I guess, in here. So we've got 54 plus another 16. We're doing 70 gold. That's not bad. We can pick up two crew members on this ship. Maybe even three would be pretty good. You get two people on the sails and then one doing repairs. That would be pretty hot. And what do we got here? Uh, journeyman thatch door. Okay. <laughs> A mythical wide medium wood gate. You need four mythos for that. Okay, so we're going to have that for a very long time. All right. I brought these bolas hoping to find something on that other island. But it was just too janky to, to do anything. So, All right. So I'm gonna, I have the big job of unloading. Now... 
let me see here. What are we at? About 5 o'clock in the afternoon? Okay, so I have the big job of unloading. Um, everybody's still alive over there? Yeah, nobody's even moved? Fantastic. We should give the rhinoceros a little try. Where's our... Oh, okay. Oh, my. Okay. We had a shark here, man. It was... It, those things are huge. <laughs> oh, man, they're huge. Get up there, buddy. There we go. I didn't realize. He kind of got stuck in here, and I took him out. And that was pretty good, actually. All right, so I have a bunch of stuff to repair as well. What do we have over here? Anything hazardous? I don't see anything spawning on this rock anymore. We used to get snakes or a pig or something spawning on those rocks, but we don't even have that anymore. I don't know what's going on there. Unless it's just been something else, but the snakes still spawn over there. But now we got, now we just got pigs. I could create quite a pig army here and just go see if we can take out a fortress somewhere. Oh, look at that. So we, we got like more beached whale over there. And I don't have my pick anymore. It broke when I was doing my gems. Okay, so let me take care of unloading this ship here. We're back home, so um, unloading and all of that is not too exciting. But uh, there you go, guys. That's going to be it for this little episode of Atlas. I will get everything in my home, and then we'll have to start working with the forge. And we're going to have to start working with uh, this little area here. we got a little more building to do. i got to make some stairs. i got to make it more comfortable to get around. Because, I mean, doing this is just ridiculous. Hello? Okay. <laughs> Jerry's a big help, but, I mean, look at this. <laughs> this is the only way to get up here. But, uh, oh, here we go. Expanding the farm is pretty good. Oh, also, I planted the cactus. That's growing like a champ. What is it? Does, was it saying anything here? Um, oh, here, harvest fruit. What does it say? No fertilizer? What? Oh, no fertilizer to deposit. Okay, no no problem. We, there's all kinds in there. We're, <clears throat> excuse me, we're doing great. So there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this crazy little trip here in Atlas. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. And hopefully, we'll see you on the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.